Today I'm going to show you how we made this Ben 10 Omnitrix. The first thing I did is bought a 3D printer and built it. Mine is Voxlab Aquila V2. Then I bought this 3D model by BHS 3D and downloaded all of the 3D files. The next step is to slice the 3D model in my slicing software. Now if you're not familiar with 3D printing or what slicing is, basically we have to run our 3D model through a program that creates instructions for the 3D printer called G-Code. This G-Code tells all of the parameters on the printer where to go in order to print our model. And now we sit back and watch as the printer brings our computer files into the real world. After the parts are done printing, the next thing I did was try to sand out all the print lines with sandpaper. I then used some automotive primer to fill the rest of the imperfections and create a nice surface for the paint to bond with. And I gave it a few coats of this. I've tried actual plastic primers before but I feel like I get a better finish with the automotive primer. I then took everything outside and gave it a few coats of this metallic spray paint. I thought this would be a nice colour to add instead of white for a live action remake of the Omniverse Omnitrix and I'm so glad I did. Wait until the end of the video to see what I'm talking about. Now that the paint's dried, it was time to take everything inside for Kayla's artistic touch. She used a mix of acrylic paints and reference images to get the colors right. Once everything had been painted and dried, we covered it with a quick coat of gloss and it was now time to assemble it. The base slides in perfectly to the strap and the dial on the faceplate fit into their slots perfectly. I'm super stoked with how this turned out. I honestly did not expect the chrome to work as well as it did and I honestly prefer this look over the white paint. Let me know what you think below and mention which watch we should make next. If you want to follow along behind the scenes on these prop making journeys then make sure to follow my Instagrams where we post regular updates that you won't see here on YouTube. As well as a secret new Omnitrix that will be revealed soon.